I am Aris Arugay from the Department of Political Science here in UP Diliman, and I will be moderating this lecture by Professor Kevin Yuson this morning, entitled Thailand, The Lessons of Protest. Uh, our, um, the cur um, this lecture is organized by the UP Asian Center and the UP Third World Studies Center. Uh, our, uh, the Dean of the Asian Center is currently uh, disposed, so we will, we'll, I'll just give a brief context on, on current Thai politics and introduce our uh, guest lecturer, Professor Hewison. Uh, those who are familiar with Thai politics uh, at present would know that it has experienced its um, 12th successful coup attempt of uh, May this year since constitutional monarchy was established in 1932 there have been 19 coup attempts 12 of which has been successful so if you average that it's been, there would the average would be there there is a coup once or more than once in a decade uh, the current coup of May 2014 uh, was a byproduct of the current uh, contentious episode in, in Thai politics, whose um, history could be traced as far back as the election of Thaksin Shinawat as Prime Minister in 2001. But the current debacle started when protests uh, were waged in October of 2013 because of a blanket amnesty bill that was being pushed by the government of Ying Lok Shinawat, who is Taksin's sister. Taksin was ousted as prime minister in, in, in a coup by the military in 2006. When the, when the amnesty bill was, um, was pushed, people poured into the streets of Bangkok protesting the blanket amnesty bill that involved not only the, the, um, those who were responsible for corruption again um, under Taksin's government, but also the extreme repression and violence that happened in May 2010 when um, protesters were um, killed because the military was mobilized to repress the protests. The failure of the amnesty bill resulted in um, the fall of Ying Lok's, um, well, the dissolution of Ying Lok's government. February 2014, there were elections of which the major opposition party, the Democrat Party, boycotted. Uh, and the results of that election were nullified by the Constitutional Court in May 2014, and also the Constitutional Court removed Ying Lok Shinawat as Prime Minister of Thailand. In May 20, the military declared martial law, and two days after, they staged military coup. So at present, there are no elected institutions governing Thailand, but what you have is a military junta who named themselves the National Council for Order and Peace. Uh, and there, currently there's an interim constitution being drafted of which will be approved, I think, in a, in a few days' time. So all these ha uh, developments in Thai politics uh, will we'll be able to have a great and, and deep analysis by one of who I consider is one of the most prominent Thai specialists in, in the world today, uh, Professor Kevin Hewison. Uh, professor Kevin Hewison is Sir Walter Murdoch Professor of Politics and International Studies and Director of the Asia Centre at Murdoch University in Perth, Western Australia. Previously, he was Weldon Thornton Distinguished Professor of Asian Studies at the University of Car uh, North Carolina, Chapel Hill. He has um, taught and um, been visiting professors in a number of educational institutions that included the Australian National University, the University of Papua New Guinea, the University of New England, the City University of Hong Kong, I could go on, Manibal University, the University of Warwick, and the Singapore Management University. A highly prolific scholar. Can't hold a joke. He has authored more than 200 publications on Southeast Asia democratization and globalization. Um, he's co-editor of a well-renowned journal, the Journal of Contemporary Asia. And I was um, doing Google research about you uh, last night. His latest, I don't know if it's the latest, but Google Scholar put this at, at, as the top result. His latest publication is in the journal um, titled Democratization, titled Considerations on Inequality and Politics in Thailand. 
wherein he argued that uh, the politicization of economic and political inequalities in Thailand has resulted in this current uh, debacle, political debacle that has put into question the, the value of democracy as well as the value of electoral representation. So without much further delay, Professor Yuvasan will deliver the lecture entitled Thailand Lessons of Protest.